What's going on guys? It is your girl Kiana. I hope that you all are doing well. I'm doing great girl. I'm, thank you for asking. I'm fabulous. I am. <laughs> well today I have a great one for you. I am going to bring you my top 10. Yeah, I said it. My top 10 candles that I love to burn, especially when I'm trying to romance a stone. I am trying to create ambiance, but I am trying to entertain the mister. You know what I mean? So what I want to do is I want to slow it down for you real quick. <laughs> we going to set the mood. We got the candle burning in the back. And oh yes, this is definitely a part of the top 10, honey. I don't play with the candles. I don't play. Okay. So before we get started though, I do want to say thank you so much to my OGs that's been with me for a minute and to my newbies. Thank you guys for subscribing. Welcome to the family y'all. And to those of you who have not subscribed yet, girl, what you waiting for? Okay. <laughs> I would love to have you a part of the family. If you love these kind of videos, I definitely love to bring you candle review videos. I love to bring you candle hauls as well as body fragrances, body perfumes, and I also love to do hygienic routines. I absolutely adore them. I always post on Tuesday and Thursday of every week, and then on Saturdays, I love to do my Pamper Saturdays. That is a new series that I just picked up. I think that if we all work hard, no matter if it's at home with the kids, girl, or we're actually going into the office, I feel like we all deserve that time to ourselves to pamper ourselves. That's our moment. That is our miracle, okay? <laughs> so if you like what you hear, definitely check out my videos. I do have playlists on my channel. And of course, stay tuned for more. But without further ado, let's get it popping. So... I just want to put out there really quick that for me, when I like to create the ambiance for me and mine, I'm going to tell you that me and mine is my preference. <laughs> I like to gravitate towards scents that may have just a hint of perfume in it, maybe a bit of masculinity, just a little bit of masculinity now, just a little bit. Or I love to have those scents that have lavender, vanilla, things of that nature. I love to have in my candles. I tend to kind of steer away from the gourmand sense because, baby, I'm going to tell you the truth. The only snack in the room is going to be Kiana, okay? <laughs> That's what I'm going for. What I want the scent to do is to be a compliment. This is the snack. That is the compliment. So when I show you, <laughs> when I show you these candles, keep that in mind, okay? <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and jump right on into the first one. So the first one that I definitely love to burn. Now, this is one that I get time and time again because I do love it. And it is a little bit masculine, but it does have a nice fruit element to it to bring it down just a notch, okay? And that is none other than mahogany coconut. Honey, mahogany coconut is amazing, okay? Now, if you know the fragrance mahogany teak wood from Bath & Body Works, then you know how strong mahogany can be. But with the coconut added into it, it definitely mellows it down just a little bit, but it creates a nice seductive scent that I love to burn in the bedroom. Okay, honey, so let me read you the notes. Creamy coconut, you have mahogany woods, and then you have English lavender. Remember what I said about essential oils. You get all of that in this candle. It is the perfect blend. It is not too masculine and it's definitely not too feminine, okay? But it definitely sets the mood for seducing, okay? <laughs> so that is my first one, okay? The next one that I love to burn and anybody that has been following me for a while knows that this is one of my top scents. I have the body care in this as well. I have to have it every year, every year for candle day, I stock up on it. And when it's time for body care day, your girl is on it too, okay? So that is none other than Cactus Blossom. Now, keep in mind, this is one of the scents that came out. I got this for a candle day a while back. I do have several of these candles. So it is in the regular signature um, white barn packaging, which is pink. Now, what I do wanna put out a special note. All of the candles that I'm bringing to you today, the majority of them, if not almost all of them, are from Bath & Body Works, but they are candles that you can get your hands on and you can get your hands on them now so you can have them for Valentine's Day or whenever you want to burn it, girl. If you want to burn it 24-7, seven days a week, you got to do what you got to do, okay? But 
this scent is so so nice it is very feminine okay when he steps in the room he gonna know what's up okay at least mr henson he know exactly what's going on all right <laughs> so in this candle these are the notes you have cactus flower petal you have sun-kissed coconut and vanilla remember what i said okay and then you have fresh sparkling lemon girl this is the perfect blend it is not too fruity it is definitely not too floral but it is so feminine so delicate so pretty and again this would be a perfect complement to whatever signature fragrance that you have honey whatever signature fragrance and if you want to see a signature fragrances of scents that make you feel sexy let me know and i'll be grateful to do that video girl sharon is karen sharon is karen this is a perfect scent and this is definitely number two okay uh, amazing now these are in no particular order so let me say this so this is the second candle that i love to burn okay the next one that i love to burn now this is an og everybody knows the og is similar to cactus blossom cactus blossom is gonna forever be at bath and body works this candle is as well it is one that i think is um often slept on but i absolutely love it and my husband loves it as well and that is none other than endless weekend honey i love this candle it is another scent to me it is something light it is something delicate it's soft and that's what you're looking for when you are trying to bring that romance into the bedroom okay definitely so in this you have fresh summer mandarin you have sun-kissed magnolia and that is actually a good scent that magnolia perfect balance and then you have blue coconut water <sighs> y'all know i love coconuts y'all know i love coconut and so far coconut is in every one of these damn scents but girl i promise you you won't get the coconut in these two scents so what scent you do not get coconut even though it's listed in um cactus blossom you don't get the coconut as it's listed in this one in this endless weekend you don't get the coconut it's simply gorgeous this scent is gorgeous again is one of those scents that will go well with any fragrance that you pair he gonna smell it at the door she gonna smell it at the door boo this is amazing okay number three <laughs> now the next one girl the next one going to shut down the studio. I don't care who you are. Like I said, I have not met a person yet who did not like this candle. Now, I'm going to say the candle. They may not be a fan of it in like the, the body care, okay? But the candle, baby, the candle is the biz naive. I'm not going to lie to you. And that is none other than Miss Champagne Toast. Girl, Champagne Toast come out oh you know it's about to go down all day long all day long this scent is so sexy to me it definitely belongs in your bedroom this is not i'm gonna tell you the truth this is not a candle that i burn throughout my house and I always burn, I always make sure, let me say that, I always make sure that whatever candle I burn in my bedroom, it is not a part of the rest of the house, okay? My husband knows what candles to burn in the living areas and throughout the other bedrooms. But in here, this is our sanctuary. Your master bedroom is your sanctuary. This is your safe haven. This is where you lay your head down and where other things go down, those extracurriculars, okay? So you should always have a separate scent that reminds you of that, okay? Side note, the more you know. <laughs> so in Champagne Toast, you have bubbly champagne, sparkling berries, juicy tangerine, yes and yes it's a lot of citrus it is a lot of citrus but it is very sweet it is juicy i can just tell you that this is sweet and it is juicy berry down okay juicy berry down mm. girl this candle smells so good 
I cannot do it justice, okay? Girl, run to Bath and Body Works. You trying to set the mood? Run to Bath and Body Works. Buy her and put her in the bedroom. And you tell me how she performs. I don't know how you, I don't want to know how you perform. I just want to know how she performs, okay? <laughs> and let me know. All right, so that is my fourth candle, okay? Now, my fifth one, now my fifth one. I was super hesitant about buying this candle. I'm not going to even lie to you. But when I got it home and I burned it the first two times, now the first time I was like, oh, okay, I see you. But then the second time, girl, the second time, I was like, oh, okay, I'll tell you what, baby, I got to go back to the store. Why? Because your girl had to go and get at least two more. I had to have two more of these candles. Now, this candle has been slept on for real because I have not seen YouTubers talk about this candle that much. I'm dead serious. They sleep on this candle, and there's no reason to sleep on this candle. This is probably one of the best candles that I've actually smelled in a very long time from Bath and Body Works that people kind of sleep on. And that is Blue Orchard Skies. Ugh. This candle smells so freaking good and it does have a hint of masculinity in it. And I think that's why I like it. It's more of a unisex candle for me. I love it. Let me read you the notes, okay? In the notes, you have pink lady apple, soft white woods, and that is probably why it's a little masculine. Then you have Fresh Orchard Air. Now, Fresh Orchard Air, girl, if Bath & Body Works be tripping, okay? That's what I'm gonna say. But for it to be like an orchard farm or something like that, I can get that, I get that. But the woods, oh my gosh, the white woods that come through, it comes through in this candle. Oh my gosh. It is sweet but masculine men and women can burn this candle so bro if you watching men and women can burn this candle again that is blue orchard skies this is what it looks like now bath and body works hopefully they still have a little bit more of these in stock they may not because this is definitely something that is older but you still could probably get it on macari if they have it hopefully it's not too hyped up but I think that this is a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful fragrance. And, oh my goodness, I love to burn this. I, it's almost like I could not stop burning this candle. I literally have one that I've already burned all the way down here. And, honey, I'm almost thinking I need to go and get it and burn it again. It smells that damn good. This is an amazing candle. Amazing performing candle as well. Now, I want to mention that every last one of these candles I have actually burned and they are very room filling. The throw is amazing. I do not have one candle here that does not have throw over at least a six or a seven. I'm just gonna tell you that. But I'm gonna tell you with the mahogany coconut one, if you have a smaller room, that could be a bit overbearing or overwhelming. Okay, it could be overwhelming. So we might wanna scale back on that one. Now, if you got a larger concept room, it will be perfect. It's a nice, mellow fragrance throughout the room. Now, let's move on to another candle. Now, I am going to say that this candle is not Bath & Body Works, but you can find it at TJ Maxx and you can find it at Marshalls, okay? Or you can simply go online and find it as well. They do have an online site. Now, this scent is probably one of my most favorite scents of all time. Now I know you guys are thinking, okay, out of all of the candles, Kiana, I love those perfume scents, but girl, when I tell you I'm about to dial it all the way back down on you, and you're going to be like, what? And I'm going to be like, yes, girl, yes. This candle is absolutely amazing. I have not smelled a version of this candle that I love more than this one, okay? The vendor hit this one out of the park. 10 stars for me, 10 stars. And that is none other than DW Home and Vanilla Bean. 
I love this candle. From the packaging to the fragrance, it is A1. It genuinely smells like they took the vanilla bean and they cut it open and they stripped it out and they put it in the creamiest of heavy whipping cream and they stirred it up real nice, girl, and added just a hint, a hint of nutmeg, just a hint, ever so slightly, and some vanilla extract. That's what they did. And that is in this candle. It is the creamiest candle ever. Now don't get me wrong, BBW does have a vanilla bean, but is it this one? No ma'am, no ma'am. But here's the best part about this girl. This candle right here, this little bitty candle. I have a fairly large master bedroom. This fills the entire room and it burns so slow that you can you save so much money. When I tell you, I'm probably gonna have this candle for about three months because it burns that slow. It is freaking amazing. And guess how much it costs, y'all? See, Sharon is caring, but guess how much it costs? Check that out. $6.99. Now they have a bigger one. A bigger one that's a two wick is $7.99. $1 up, girl, girl, you better shut your mouth when I tell you jump on it. Thank me later. Now I'm gonna tell you if you're in this Augusta area, baby, don't take all of them, okay? Let's leave me some, <laughs> all right? But this candle, when I tell you this candle does set the mood right, you know what time it is, but it's also calming and it goes perfect with your relaxation day. I would love to burn this candle on a Pamper Saturday. It's a versatile candle is what I'm telling you. It is very versatile. So it's amazing, amazing. So again, it's a compliment. So all of these are complimentary scents. You the snack girl, you the snack. This just creating an aromatherapy to lay it down. You understand? This is to lay the foundation down. Okay? <laughs> so, that is another scent for me. Now, this one. Girl, this is an OG. This is an OG. Everybody know. As soon as I... It doesn't even need an introduction. But I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to read you the notes. Okay? Y'all ready for this? Dark cherry. Black raspberry. Merlot. Bath and Body Works heads. What y'all think I'm about to call? Baby, you got it. You got it. Because this candle right here alone, she got it. Black Cherry Merlot. This is a sexy, seductive scent. Okay? Amazing scent. Oh my God. Mmm. It is the sweetest scent, strongest scent, filled with berries, honey. It's filled with berries. Oh my gosh. This will never get old. And yes, you do get that Merlot. Merlot is a sexy drink, honey. And so is this candle. I'm telling you, you would not go wrong. Now, this is a very strong candle. So whatever fragrance that you have on, make sure, girl, that it is only gonna make this a compliment. So that's another one. Now, one that I just purchased. And of course, if you just saw my last haul, y'all know what it is. Y'all know what it is. I'm gonna be burning it on Valentine's Day. Yes, I already burned one. And the throw was amazing, girl. It was everything that I thought it would be and more. Understand that, hear me. Go get it when they have a candle sale. Now, word is on the street that the candle sale is going to be probably this weekend because they always do one when SAS is about to end. SAS ends on January the 18th. Sass ends on January the 18th. So y'all can't say now. Y'all cannot say Kiana didn't tell you. January 18th. But I had to pick this up. So as soon as that candle sale come, every last one of y'all need to be throwing this in the bag. Bubbly Rosé. Baby, just the name. Rosé, 
you know what time it is. I can already see it. Chocolate covered strawberries. White wine on the side. And my little chocolate milk dud laying right beside me. <laughs> Amazing. This is the perfect show stopper, okay? I love it. I already have a fragrance that I cannot wait to pair with this candle, okay? Is that serious? Oh my gosh, when I tell you that champagne note is the force is strong with this one, girl. <laughs> it is strong with this one. Let me read you the notes, girl. Let me read you these notes. Okay, so you got pink sparkling rose. Then you have sweet blood orange and then a splash of cranberry juice. Yes, you get all of those notes, but that rose, that rose hit a little different, honey. Love this fragrance. It is just perfect, gorgeous, splendid. Highly, highly, highly recommend. This candle is on a throw of like an eight. I am not lying to you. And in the bedroom, shh, girl, stop. Girl, stop. Okay? Now, I do have two more candles left. This one is for my floral lovers, okay? Yes, I don't discriminate when it comes to scents, honey. I don't discriminate when it comes to scents. I love all kinds of scents. I love floral base. I love gourmand scents. I love citrusy scents. I love, obviously, beverage drink scents. I love them all. Fruity scents, that's me. I love everything. And I like to be versatile. That's what I like to change it up from every now and then. I love to change it up. So when I smelled this candle, it was so pretty to me, so delicate. And that is Perfect Peony. This candle smells so good. So, so good. Even from the packaging. Look at this packaging, y'all. It's so timeless and pretty. I love it. So, in this, they have Pink Lady Apple. They have Zorbe Peony. And then Vanilla Sandalwood. Remember what I said about that vanilla? And then when you throw in a sandalwood or even a white wood, it always takes the candle over the top okay it gives them that oomph that it actually needs to be successful okay to me this candle is so pretty you do get that pink lady apple so you get a slight hint of apples but when i tell you you get the majority of the candle smells straight up like peony and i'm not mad at it i am not mad at it this is one that i would call sweet and sensual Makes you feel like a lady you know what I mean and when I say a lady I mean feminine delicate soft voluptuous this is it I love it love it so my next candle oh god y'all let me be careful because I don't want to blow it out because I'm not gonna blow it out girl this is my boo boo <laughs> my baby now this is an OG this candle is not going anywhere. This is one of White Barn's signature scents. It is around year round 365, okay? 365, and I promise you every candle day, I am going to get it so I will never run out of this candle. Now the packaging has been updated, meaning just the font, everything. When I tell you it is sweet, it is masculine, but I do think the masculinity I think comes from the essential oils that Bath & Body Works actually adds into the candle. We all know that essential oils are added to every last one of the candle fragrances from Bath & Body Works. So I think that's why this one is a touch bit masculine, but it's a perfect unisex candle. This candle can be in the same family as Blue Orchid Skies. That's what I would say. Definitely a unisex candle. It is soft, it is sweet. It is definitely one of those seductive candles that you would love to burn into your room. Baby, baby, baby. My husband absolutely loves this candle. Strongly recommend this candle. Ladies, try it out and thank me later.
Let me know in the comments if you have this scent and let me know how you feel about it. Matter of fact, if you have any one of these scents, let your girl know and tell me how you like to burn them because your girl love to burn these candles only in her master. Only. <laughs> Well, guys, that is all that I have for you guys today. I really and truly hope that you enjoyed today's video. It was fun. It really was. If you guys have any recommendations for me, definitely let me know in the comment section. I love to read those, and I definitely love to go to Bath & Body Works and pick up what you recommend. Sharon is Karen, and I love to do that here on this channel. We are a positive vibes only channel, and of course, I love, I love when you bring me all of that positive energy, girl. I love it. So I look forward to seeing you guys in the next one. Remember, I post videos on Tuesdays and Thursdays. And then, of course, you have Pampa Saturdays. And I cannot wait. So I will catch you guys in the next one. Much love, many blessings. Peace.